We're going to read Our Big Home, and this book looks at some of the things we're talking about this week, as far as night and day, and it also looks at some of the things we've been looking at with regard to our gardens. So let's read Our Big Home. It's an earth poem, and it's by Linda Glasser, and the art is by Alyssa Clevin. Our Big Home. Let's see. We share the water. We splash and slosh and swim in water. And of course, we all drink water. Whales, dolphins, manatees, penguins, palm trees, you and me. We all share the water here on Earth, our big blue home. So look at all those great things they're doing. They're doing all these things with the water. The animals live in the water. We drink the water. We like to swim and play in the water. Rain slides down my nose and trickles in between my toes. Rain cleans the whole world. It waters forests of giant trees and wakes up life in tiny seeds. It brings fresh water to you and me. We all share the rain here on earth, our green growing home. And you guys don't forget, we were looking at our plants and how we keep them growing. And to grow a plant, we need the rain or the water. They need water so that they can grow. The sun warms us all around the world. Sunflowers, sparrows, apple trees, foxes, ferns, and you and me. Warm fingers and toes, warm roots and leaves. We all share the sun here on earth, our big sun-warmed home. So you see, this is the sun. We looked at it before because we know our plants need the sun to grow. They need the sun. But we're looking at the sun this week so that we can look at what things look like in the day and what things look like at night. So we see the sun in the day. We see the sun during the daytime. And there's dirt all around our earth, our ground. So where seeds wait and where trees are born, where earthworms live and rabbits dig, earth that holds life, dirt that feels good under my feet. We all share the soil here on earth, our big life-holding home. So you can see down here all this dirt. Can you see it's like this brownish color? All the dirt. We've looked at dirt too because plants need dirt so that they can keep growing. They need the dirt. They need the sun, they need the water. And there's air everywhere, far, far away and right next door. We all breathe Earth's air. Ah, doesn't it feel good to breathe? People, lizards, ladybugs, oak trees, sweet peas, even weeds. We all share the air here on Earth, our big fresh aired home. So we need air so that we can breathe. Our plants need air too. All of our plants can only grow if they have air. Wind whooshes and whirls and sweeps and swirls. It stirs the grass and shakes the trees. It carries rain and spreads new seeds. It brings fresh air. It blows kids' hair. All around the world, wind touches us all here on Earth, our big whirling home. So you see? They also have the wind. We need the wind. It blows things around. It carries our seeds for our plants. We need the wind. What's this one, you guys? It's the sky. It's the sky. The sky, our huge changing picture up there. I love our sky, don't you? Great sweeps of blue, dabs and swirls of clouds, wild splashes at sunset. Wherever we are, we look up and see sky, sky, sky. Here on earth, our big home under the sky. We need the sky, look. The sky brings us the rain that our plants need. The sky holds the sun, which we all need. And it's so beautiful. Look at all those pretty colors in the sky. See some pinks and some blues. And what else do we see? I see a rainbow in the sky. 
Well, this is something else we're looking at. It's the night. It's night time. So this whole week we're looking at day and night. This one is our night. The night when stars sparkle in the deep, endless deep. The hushed time when we sink into sleep. When night animals roam and night flowers bloom. We all have a time of darkness here on earth, our home under the big blanket of night. So look, we know it's night. We can see so many little stars. Do you see all the stars? Stars, stars, stars. When you look up at the sky at night, there's so many stars. So you know we're going to be making some fun stars this week. And our moon travels across the sky, a creamy pearl, a thin white sail. Full moon, new moon shaping our night. We all share the moon here, there, and everywhere on earth. Our big moonlit home. So this is something else that we see at night. It's the moon. It's the moon. We see the moon at night and we see the stars at night. You can see some of these guys are. Because we at least, we sleep at night. When I stretch or dance or hop or laugh, when I leap in the air or lay in the grass, I feel alive. We all have that aliveness. Trees, frogs, bees, grass, spiders, snakes, earthworms, bats. We all share life, every one of us, here on Earth. Our big life-giving home. Look at all these animals and plants and fish. There's so much stuff here that has life. We share air, water, soil, sky, sun, rain, and being alive. And we all share one home here on earth, one precious living home. That's the end. See even more stars. Thank you for listening with me all about our big home. We got to see some stuff about our gardens and what our plants need. We got to see some stuff about day and night. This is all stuff that's here at our big home on earth.